Good morning. We are going to discuss about what is called interfunction communication. There are two ways of the communication between functions. What is called call by value and call by reference. I have uh, explained in my previous lecture what is meant by call by value. Now coming to what is called call by reference. Uh, uh, call by reference or call through uh, pointer. However, this is very frequently used word, not through the pointer. So when you go by this, the diagrammatically say calling function or calling function is the main function and the called function is the function called change. So we clearly observe that this is the calling function will send a value and the called function will return the values. So to uh, give an idea about how they do it, we write the diagram draw the diagram. So here pay attention to this a function called change. So we are telling that the void function change and I said int asterisk you can see writing a variable name is optional if you want you can write a variable name like p it is optional. So in my main function I have written uh, some statements here the first statement I say int m and it is assigned a value 5. So we say that it is declared and defined. We say the value variable, you know that variable name is nothing but the name given to a memory location. So the value present here is 5. And uh, you said the next statement is print the value of m. So the value of m is 5 here. It's fine. Then you are calling the function change with the m variable and we are passing its address. So what happens is immediately the control is transferred to this. And uh, here there is one variable called p. Please recall uh, our uh, exercise on what is a pointer and other things. So in my example of one pointer, so I have said that pointer is a variable like any other variable but the only difference is it can store address of the variable of the type of one it belongs to so you say int so this variable p can hold addresses of integer kind of variables so here in your calling function i mean our main function m is a variable let us say its address is somewhere in a a B 5 so what happens is this address is taken into this P variable so you say A B 5 is the value which has been received into P that's what you should be able to understand and once you have received it so this call through pointer or call by reference then the first statement is a printf slash and percentage P so we have written this indirection operation in star p. So the moment it has received this, the other name for this m will be star p or asterisk p. Then you said printf percentage is asterisk p. The value of asterisk p is 5 here. So this is done. And he said asterisk p plus plus. So this is changed now. So whatever 5 was there, that has become 6 now. It has 6 become. It has become 6 now. So this 5 is gone and 6 has come. And then you said percentage, print of percentage uh, D again the slash P. Now the value of, uh, when I am saying star P or asterisk P, it is the dislocation to the referring. So it is 6 now. So there is no other statement here. Next. Therefore, the, the, your control will return back to the statement following this change. So the next statement, so after the year, it comes here. So you are saying the percentage D, printf percentage D, M. So the same location has two different names. So, so M. So M or asterisk P, both are same. Therefore, the value of M, it prints 6. So in the whole process, what you have to understand is that the it is sending it a value 
and it is returning a value and hence we say the call by reference and this parameter we call it as actual parameter and this parameter we say a formal parameter so in case of this call by reference or this one the changes made to the formal parameters will affect the actual parameters but as far as the c language is concerned uh, the formal parameter is actually referring to the actual parameter only that's what you should understand so if the changes made to the formal parameters are affecting the actual parameters we call it as call by reference thank you